Today we're going to determine a chemical formula. Be careful to do all your work under the hood. Obtain a crucible and its cover, but be careful. These are expensive and fragile. If there is any loose dirt or other gunk in your crucible, wash it away with a little water and a paper towel. If that doesn't work, it's time to bring in the cavalry. Place the crucible on the triangle on the ring stand. If it doesn't fit, you can always adjust these, the size of the triangle, manually. Try it, then heat it intensely for five minutes. Seriously, turn up the heat. Handle the crucible with your tongs in order to avoid getting oils and extra weight on the crucible. Allow the crucible to cool and weigh it. Now, let the chemistry begin! Add a half gram of magnesium and turn the heat back on. If you heat it gently, you should get a nice reaction with oxygen to produce magnesium oxide. Heat it slowly and if it begins to smoke, immediately remove it from the heat source and cover it. If it ignites, don't look directly at the light. Once oxidized, the magnesium metal changes color to a much duller gray, like when iron rusts. Allowed to cool and weigh. Use a watch glass to hold it as oil will attach to the crucible. Repeat this heating and cooling step in order to ensure the crucible is dry by weighing it. Now add a little water and heat it again. This will allow any nitrogen to come out as ammonia. You might get a funny smell, well, that's ammonia. 